how are you guys this is ibu learning today video i am going to show you how you can make a structural connection where uh, a steel beam is connecting with concrete uh, wall or column so here you go now i will go to file in i will go to choose new project in architectural template from here i will go to wall then i will draw one wall here this wall property this uh, constant is level 1 and top is unconnected i will give 5 meter just now i will move to level 2 i'll go to the structural tab then i will choose beam then i will go to draw one beam here now it's not visible because i have to check detail level if i do fine it's showing here but still it's on uh, i cannot select this because uh, i have to change view range this is i can give minus 500 so now it's okay just i will align this line to here and i will give gap 30 mm sorry see I have concrete wall and the beam here now I'll move to a steel tab I'll choose plate and then I will go to set pick a plan then I will choose this plan okay then I will go to front I will choose rectangle to draw the plate just I trace the same beam size and then I can give the offset like 100 mm offset outside so once it's draw I will just delete this line so I have base plate this one then I will click ok make sure this is fine ok yes now this is showing here I will go to again 3D and I will check it's already in 3D so in home tab you can see this is the plate this is beam it's ok next I will go to level 2 plan and here also I will go to check now here I will go to it's not showing the plate here so I will go to visibility and graphic VG and then I will type a structural I will go to find the structural connection a structural connection and I expand this I can see here this all is not selected so I will go to select all this and check this then I'll hit OK. So here you can see here now it's showing. Now plate thickness I'll just select this one. This thickness is 2.7 meter. I will give 20 mm thickness. So now this is the plate. Next I will go again 
in 3D and then I will go to front view I need to draw another plate here connecting with the beam so I will go to plate rectangle this time also I will choose rectangle and then I will draw plate here this plate thickness I will give 16 mm and this is far from here around 10 mm and this one 16 mm okay. and then I will just check this and length I can give 250 and I will try to move this type MV center to the center of this beam okay, again I will just move because I have to give the 10 mm so I will give 10 mm so this is the plate once it uh, ok now ok then you will go to 3D make sure this is I go to check in wireframe mode it's already there now the thickness because I draw now I will give thickness 150 extrude this plate 150 or I can give more so this is around 250 150 is enough okay. now I will again move to the level 2 plan and then I will just mirror this one this connection other side also uh, one more thing I have to do here I need to align this move I need to align this line to here and then I delete this now I will mirror this one from here to here so now this is the plate make sure this is 150 ok so now I have plate and then all thing is uh, set now I will go to 3D and then I can see shade mode then I have everything is set up now I will go to draw the uh, bolt I will go to bolt anchor and then I will choose this plate then hit enter I have to select the face then I will go to draw the line of the anchor position now here I will just pick the corner and then I will check ok here I can see all the corner its anchor bolt is there so now I will keep the selected bolts and then I will go to property here I will just modify this 50 I need from corner 50 50 then ok then here you go you can see that uh, the bolt is updated now I need uh, number of bolt increase the number of bolt so here I need 4 bolts ok so this is now again here I have to go to the bolt I will go steel and now this time I need only bolt through bolt not the anchor bolt so I will select this I will hit enter and then I will choose the face of the plate and then again I will do the same this time I will just change the wireframe to just trace the correct line from here to this is the plate okay here this time also I will check okay and then again I will go back to shed mode and then this time I will give the dimension from the corner 
30 mm 35 35 now select ok apply and then here you go this is this one I need to be change three bolts so this one okay now I can see here this both plate is not connected so I will do one thing I will go to uh, change this wireframe or I will go to level 2 plan it's better you can see here and then I will select this bolt and this bolt I have to give grip length here grip length I will give from here to here how much I need I will just measure this dimension from here to here I think uh, I need this one 42 mm I will just try to put this value 42 mm and then I can see here it's already connected the bolt length will increase so both plate is connected now another one more thing I have to do I will go in 3D now and then I will just change this shed mode I will go to again a steel and then this time I will go for to choose the weld so this time I will choose this plate this plate enter and then I will weld at this corner and I will again I will go to select weld I will select this plate control select another plate hit enter and then pick the weld location so here you can see here this is the weld it's showing that weld this is the property of the weld and then this side also so this plate if I will hide this command H, H temporary hide so you can see this plate is welded with this base plate which is connecting with the concrete with anchor and this beam is connecting with this plate so like this you can modify now I have to just go to change this uh, uh, structure concrete now here I will choose concrete cut casting place then ok apply and here you can see its material change and now from here you can make it like a 40 percent so you can see here we change the just I change transparency here so you can see thanks for watching please subscribe for upcoming videos thank you